Hello, I'm Tony from Midtown Health and today's topic is to move more. Your challenge for the week is to build five to 10 minutes of additional movement into your day. Would you believe that sitting is worse for your health than smoking? It's true. Recent studies have shown that sitting an average of four to six hours per day doubles your risk of early death. This happens because with a sedentary lifestyle, you are more likely to eat mindlessly while sitting for prolonged periods of time impacting your blood pressure and muscle tone. Benefits of moving more include increased blood flow, managing proper blood sugar, and relief from joint pain and stiffness. It also provides for more consistent energy levels throughout the day. Take breaks every hour, get up and walk around. Even a few minutes of movement can help to break the cycle of prolonged sitting. Set a timer or set up reminders on your calendar to get up and move around during your day. Even if you exercise consistently for a chunk of time each day, you can still benefit from adding movement into your day and breaking up prolonged sitting. The goal is to condition yourself to form a habit. Your success rate will increase tremendously. Take the stairs. If you're on the 10th floor, just walk up the first few and take the elevator or escalator from there. Plan lunch out with your coworkers to a walking destination at least once per week. Park further away. This doesn't necessarily mean the last parking spot. Just head towards the middle of the lot rather than competing for the closest spot will be an improvement. Talk to a coworker instead of sending an email. This may improve the result of your communication as well as improving your health. Consider standing up every time the phone rings. Hold meetings while standing or walking. If you are leading a meeting that is lengthy, organize stretch breaks throughout the event. If you travel, most likely you will sit all day. Use the ironing board in your hotel room to work on and give yourself some standing time. Don't eat at your desk, but if you do, take a lap around your office. If you don't have a desk job or you already move a lot during the day, remember that your body quickly adapts to the amount of movement that you do. Mix it up, take different routes, if you're on your feet all day, make sure that you move your arms and stretch your back. At home, try walking the dog instead of just opening the back door. This week's challenge is to build five to 10 minutes of additional movement into your existing day. We are excited that you have accepted our challenge. We look forward to seeing your results. This is Midtown Health, keeping your organization healthy.